Hey guys, it's Duke Redneck Rebel Jar here. Now I'm going to be showing you how to catch grasshoppers. Um, you're about to find out why Redneck is in my YouTube name. So let's get right to it. Okay guys, um, the first thing we want to talk about is what to wear to grasshopper hunting. I recommend as much camo as you can get. I got my camo hat, my camo jacket, and some barn boots and jeans. They won't see me coming. You got to make sure to not wear bright colored clothes or they'll see you coming from miles away. The second thing I want to talk about is scent. So, those little things, can they can smell you from yards, miles, all the way from the other um, end of a yard or field. So what you gotta do is you gotta get some grass on the ground just like this. You can just pick up any grass. You wanna rub it all over you, get that sand on you so they can't smell you. You gotta blend in with your environment. Okay, the next thing you need to know is you gotta let the grasshoppers come to you. So you just wanna camp somewhere. You gotta get your grasshopper bait. What you wanna do is you wanna make a pile of grass so they're attracted to your feet. Okay, so you're baiting them out. Then you just wait there. You wait there and you wait there. And then when you see one, wait for the perfect moment. I like to use the hide and grab technique. That's where you come up behind them like so and you just grab them right out of the ground. Now these grasshoppers are good for fishing too. That's the main purpose of using them. But you guys can use them for whatever you want. And the last thing I forgot to mention is, well, you can't really catch grasshoppers grasshoppers in November so if it's cold outside you probably don't want to go grasshopper hunting thanks guys for watching if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe until then I'll see you next time